It's Sunday morning, about 10 o'clock. I'm just starting to move around, building a fire. But we always check it, look at the pool, and if we can know it's raining when we look at it. We see the water falling on it. Here we are in the kitchen. We got a fresh uh, pineapple that Larry's going to clean. I got to make a fruit tray today, so he's working on it. He's, he's cleaned these before, but it's been a couple years. So, oh, there's the top. Now, you're going to plant your top or just throw it out? No, I'm going to throw it out. It takes too long to make yeah. it out. Yeah, a couple, a few years ago, he saved the top, and it grew pretty good in the greenhouse for a while, but like he says, it just takes so long. So, you're cutting off the bottom? Bottom and the top to start with. Cut off the bottom and the top to start with. Both ends cut off. Slicing down the side of it. Try to get as many seeds out as you can. Well, it's got seeds on there you're trying to get out. The, those are the seeds. Mm -hmm. Waste a little bit, but not that much. There's still plenty of pineapple there. You want me to hold this, keep it from turning? Mm -hmm. Hmm? Yeah. Get a few more of the seeds. Mm hmm. I'm gonna bite down into them. It smells good. Good and ripe. It's a mark down, that's the way to buy them. And they're more juicy. I don't remember what that one cost. Two dollars even. It's two dollars even? Yeah. Well, that's looking good. Rinse it off. Okay. one little spot right there. Is that a seed? Yeah. Go back and get a few off. Uh... Okay, kind of about a quarter inches pieces. Some nice chunks. Okay. I'd say that looks like about a half inch. Well, let's go a little less. Boy, you come close to the tip of your finger every time. <laughs> Sorry. You know what I'm doing. Get blood all over the pineapple, it wouldn't be very appetizing. No. That's looking good. Just cut the center out. Okay. You want a smaller knife for that? Yeah. I think they got a regular cutter you can do, but this is just as easy. Mm -hmm. Oh, maybe a, a donut hole cutter. I wonder if that would work. They make them. I think the donut, special for that. The donut hole cutter is probably bigger. In that center. 
There it is. Okay. Two dollars. <throat> It'll be a real nice, sweet. It'll be a nice addition to the fruit tray. Mm. <clears throat> I gotta look and see if I've got enough fancy toothpicks up there to take in with it. If I don't, I'll just have to take the plain ones. Is, it, is that center part tough? Yeah, it's real hard. You can't eat it. <clears throat> I'll make sure you get enough of the center out or it'll be a little bit bitter if you don't get enough of the center out. This one's a little thin. We might have to eat this ourselves. Oh, that small one? Mm -hmm. Well, we have to taste test to make sure it's good enough to take, too. Could lay that one over separate. I already got one separate. Uh Don't have to be perfect circles because we're going to be cutting them in hunks anyway. Mm -hmm. That's it. Okay. I don't know how long it took, but it's done. Take very long. Are you going to cut them in hunks now? Are you? I bet you could just cut down through that whole stack, maybe, and cut them all at one time. This one on the end might be, I'm going to keep it out just in case, too. Yeah. I'll try it, but it's kind of slippery. How big are chunks? You want? Oh, eighths, I guess. Cut it in both ways and then cut it again, like a pie. Okay. Cuts real easy. It's real tender and juicy. Cause those hunks are still just a little bit too big, aren't they? Wait a minute. You think that hunk is too big, or is that about right? Got the tray out. I'm going to put them on. So do that. It won't hurt for you to see it anyway. A little more sour on the end. Mm -hmm. I should have cut more off. You don't want to waste it. I guess if I get, if there's any extra, I can put them in a plastic container and just take it. If you need any more? No. Because I got to have room. Here. You wouldn't. They wouldn't even tell you to bring this. strawberries out and wash them. I think before when we had strawberries we left the little ends on them. That way you can kind of hold on to the ends yeah. while you're dipping it. Mm -hmm. Take all that out and bury it in the garden. Multiply. And multiply.
Maybe I need a bigger tray. No, I, th I think this will work. Yeah, I'll probably. good. Here's our completed fruit tray with grapes and strawberries and pineapple and then the bowl there in the middle is going to be full of Nutella for chocolate to just dip whatever you want in. All done. Ready to take. Well, it's the whole outside of the fellowship hall. It's not real large. We've got blue bows, and pink bows on the doors. Looks nice. Okay. And go on in. They've already got everything set up. Decorated. Oh, that's cute on top of the piano. Got a pink balloon. Here's the gift table. I don't know if it's a boy or a girl. I'll just put mine there with the others. And that's cute. They got the table all ready. Looks nice. Well, maybe it's a boy. They've got blue. Well, Indians and toys all around the punch bowl. Nice. Well, I gotta. Chip and dip. Oh, those are those are good. They were gonna buy those little yellow cakes too. Oh. <laughs> All done. Got the Nutella in the middle now. Just putting it in the fridge. We have uh, corsages too for the mother. Okay. Three of them in here. Okay. Things ready for the party. Just, uh, we'll just have to party without me. Well, we're going to have eggs mm -hmm. and homemade biscuits mm -hmm. and uh, cardboard bacon, Yeah, which is soy bacon. So, if I, if, but no grits. If I get grits, I'll have to cook them myself. So if I ever get married again, I'm going to marry a girl raised in the south, not in the north. <laughs> so I can have my grits. Yeah. And G-R-I-T stands for girl raised in the south. <laughs> That's exactly right. Get some grits, girls. So if you want grits tonight, fans over there on the stove. I'm making the bacon, the eggs, and the biscuits, and maybe some orange juice is in there left. Gotcha. Here's my biscuits just coming out of the oven. If you remember on March the 16th is when I uh, shared my mix on how, how to, to make them. So this is my two biscuits. Okay. Here we have it, Sunday supper. Let's go in and dig in. You can talk in English, ain't it? Oh, okay. Uh, you want here? Here we are in the kitchen. We got a fresh grapefruit that Larry's gonna. It's not a grapefruit. Ah. It's a pineapple. Wait. <laughs> mm -hmm. 